Yeehaw! Howdy, partners, and welcome to Ranch Team Mahoney. I best get inside there and corral up all my kiddos. We got a lot of work going on, and when we working hard, we learning hard. Let's see what's going on inside Ranch Team Mahoney. One day I went with my horse, dog and cat, to the market. I am the owner of the large barn. I am the rancher. My horse attacks my cat because they're friends. I sold a stray dog in and I sold it for a profit to my friend. The desert was full of horses. I had a partner named Tommy it, and it was a boy. My partner was train, training his horse, Tommy. My horse is named Black Beauty. Yeehaw. Do a to the cat. Make sure nobody is just messing in the car. Be careful for wranglers. Take my rifle. I'm going to look for stay with my own horse. Be back in a bit. Round up all the cattle. Protect them so we can make a big profit at the market. Shoot anybody trying to steal some cattle. Yeehaw. Howdy, I work with the rustlers. Every day I have to corral the cattle that belong to the ranchers. I take stray cattle. When I start, I, we start sending rodeos in spring. The sheriff puts my picture on wanted posters signs at the market. I never pay my profit. I live a hard life by trying to take cattle. Doing this is hard. There are many stampedes. I, it takes skill to be a wrestler. I am often hurt during a stampede. My group gets short after a stampede. That's all about me. Yeehaw. The ranchers are having trouble keeping their cattle in the crowd. I think that someone is stealing them. I found a stray just outside of town. I had my brother tending to keep it safe. A cowboy's work is never done. Yeehaw. One day, my horse and I went riding in the front of the market. When we finished riding in the front, we went to the back of the market. When we were riding in the back of the market, we saw a stray dog. When we went for apples. It was a profit because at the store, they are $2. And the other market was $1. When we got home, it always seems like I'm the only one to One day, my friend Bob called me. He said, hey Tom, I'm sick. I was wondering if you could tend to me. Okay, I'll be there in a minute. Okay, bye. Jasmine, I'm tell Ranger Thief, don't let them trespass. Keep stray cattle away from mine so nobody will think that I am a thief. Make sure that you corral the cattle if they get loose. Don't let them get out. Then I got on thunder and went off to Bob's house. When I got there, Bob said, can you go put my cattle in my corral for me. So I did. Then he said, that's all. You can go home. Are you sure, Bob? Yeah. Thanks, Tom. You're welcome. I went home on Thunder. The next day, Bob came over and said, thanks. Then he helped me with my cattle and my horses. Jasmine didn't let nobody trespass, and she kept my cattle crowd, and nobody stole anything. One day, there was a cowgirl and a horse named Apples. The cowgirl and Apples came upon a cowboy. The cowgirl said that she got a stray horse. She said that she is finding a market to buy apples. The cowboy said that I had to be tending his horse named Oreo. The cowgirl said, aw, oh, man. The cowgirl started to yell and cry. The cowboy said that I have a tradition that I had to go and I can't bring Oreo. The cowgirl said okay. 
The cowgirl also said, what, what day do I have to babysit Mr. Oreo? The cowboy said, on Tuesday, and I need more profit to buy stuff for the tradition. They said, okay. When it was Tuesday and the cowboy was gone, the cowgirl almost forgot about her mom's birthday and apples. The cowboy came back and didn't see the cowgirl. And he didn't see Oreo either. The cowboy saw a note. It said, I forgot about my mom's birthday and apples, my horse. I went to the desert and went to my mom's birthday party. P.S. I also took Oreo. When the cowgirl arrived, she said, I'm so, so sorry that I didn't tell you that I had plans. The cowboy said, where is Oreo? Oh, Oreo's at his playhouse and laying down in the sun. The cowboy said, why did you take Oreo? The cowgirl answered, because I didn't know if I could take him or not. I took him because he wanted to, and I didn't want to leave him by himself. The cowboy said, this is your last day. The cowgirl started to cry and started to run to her house. When the cowgirl was at her house, she started to calm down and was happily ever after. Yeehaw! I was in town looking for somewhere to hide because I stole a guy's a horse from a guy and he got mad. Then I had to knock him out so he would hush up. Now, the sheriff tried to take me to jail. I tried to hide in the market, but they found me and tried to catch me. On the way, we almost ran into a corral, but my, but the horse jumped over it and kept going. You could see the whole town coming to get me, but I kept going and going, and finally I got rid of them. Uh, I went far away from the the town and never went back. I profited a lot of money so I could tin my horse. Me and Neil and my horse we dreamed around in the desert with my brother Austin and his little player. We see some strange animals. We walk up to them. We know we will have to give them a life. We continue to look around. We come upon a corral of animals. So we got that somebody on the ranch. Soon a sweet old lady walks out of the house and, says, and she says, Well, guess I have company. How may I help you? She said again. My brother and I will want one thing to know. Is this your cat and dog? The old lady says, No. We head on. Then we track a snake. Oh, no. It bites Larry. So we rushed the horse back to the ranch. And when we get there, I bandage the horse's ankle. After a while, we ride our horses to the market and sell the animals for a profit so they will have a loving home. Soon we came upon some bulls. We hurried to get all lassoes quick so we can lasso the bulls. We take them to the market for even more profit. Somebody buys both bulls. We continue to ride through the desert to get to our ranch. When we got there, our leader gives us all food. After we take a shower and then we go to bed, I wake up in the middle of the night because I am moving in the leaves. It was a snake that bit Larry. I cut the snake and made the fire. I dropped the snake in, in the fire and burned the snake. My brother wakes up and says, what's all the racket? I told him about the snake and we, we don't have any more problems. Howdy partner, what's your name? Jake, nice name. My name is Jake. Well, I ha we'll have to go corral up some horses. Tomorrow we can go to the market. See you later, partner. I'm going to ask a ranger if I can round up some of his animals. Next week, I have to go tending. Do you want to come help me corral up some horses? Sure, let's go. Yeehaw, giddy up. Well, I have to go, I have to go. See you later, giddy up. Well, I have, I have to go. See you tomorrow, okay? Good night. Honk. 
Good morning. Hey there. Hey, there you are. Hey, look. Ro chicken, roast beef, and tuna salad. They have, they have everything. I'm going to buy the tuna salad and the chicken. All together, it is $4.25. Did I give you the right profit? Uh, yes. Oops, time to go. Tindy. See you later. Yeehaw. Hey, James. Hey. What have you been up to? Nothing. Well, are you okay? Yes, sir. Here is all the stuff you need. Thanks. See you later. It's time to put the cattle in the corral. I was working when I got a call, so I had to tend the cows. There was a stray dog. I wanted to help, but I couldn't. Finally, I helped the dog by taking it to the market to sell him to a good home. I then went to a show and I made lots of profit. I used the money to buy clothes. When I got new clothes from me, I had a lot more money, and I got some for everybody else. Later, we had a campfire and sang songs. Hi there, sir. I am a rancher, and I am taking this stray and making him my horse. I will name it the Wrangler. My name is Mac. I am taking this cow to the market to get some money to buy some corn seeds. I will grow the corn and sell it for profit. I will corral some cows tomorrow. I will see you later. It is getting late. Bye. Howdy. I'm Malia. I have a horse named Rex. He loves to eat hay and grass, too. Also, I have a friend who lives in the town. Her name is Sally, but I live in the desert with my horse. Tending you, you can take care of your horse. You quite get it, too. My friend is coming to my house today, but on her way, she got straight on her way to my house. When she got to we went to the market in her town to get good goods that are sold. So I took her home. She has food to get her farm. She has a corral of farm animals. She needs you need to wrestle the cow and come back to the desert tomorrow. Go to the market to get corn that has been sold. Me and my friend went riding on our horses desert. We got straight, but we thought our way out. Well, I'll rob the bank for you unless you pay me a profit of $500. Okay, I will pay you unless you rob the market too. Okay, I will do that. Howdy, partner. Give me all the money. Here, here. Here is the money to, to, to take it all. Call the cops if you want to get, want to get hurt. Howdy, partner. Give me the money. No, I'm calling the cops. You shouldn't have done that. Did you rob the, mar the bank and the market too? Yes and no. Did you rob the market? Yes. Did you rob the bank? No. Why? Because you know I don't have to have a gun. Here is you. Here is your gun. Thanks. Now I want you to to steal a cow from Mr. Mahoney's corral and do it right. While, I'm, while I am attending to ride a horse. How is Stray Horse? What are you doing out here by yourself in the West? Well, I got to go corral some cows and go to the market so I can sell you for a profit. You're still here? Well, I Until your owner comes and find you. Now get in the field the first of riding. You are a good horse. I guess I'll just keep you. 
five bunnies. I've got a corral in my backyard. In my house, I've got fellow ranchers that's tending my to my mom. Tomorrow, we will start getting straight cattle. I am a bandit, and I steal horses and cattle. Or I go to the market in town and buy them. But my friends sell things like lasso's boots and vests, and gives me and gives me profit. Hey, I'm Angel. This is my horse, Alex. We are riding around, and I am practicing my roping on a cactus. So I, so one day. I can do the same to a real pig. I wish I could have a corral one day. I will go to the market to see if they have some to buy. I am very tending to my horse. One day, I hope to be a full-time rancher. Well, if you have a horse, maybe you can do the same thing and you can practice roping like me. I am going to go back to practice to my practicing, maybe you can practice with a cactus like I will. Cows are cool, but cowboys are cooler. Cowboys and horses are the characters of the story. Go down to the corral to get the cows to eat. The cows need to be fed to food to be healthy so we can eat them. Cowboys eat the cows but they can't do it until they are healthy because they do not want to die. Cow cowgirls need to go get the food to survive but a stranger might Come and steal a stray horse and sell it at the market. And then they discuss what profit they made. I'm feeding my horse my dog to I am a rancher at court. I sprout animals and my animals will stay sometimes too. I will never do something bad to my animals. When I leave without them, they are scared. When my dog is the only one home, he is not scared. He guards the house. When we are asleep, my dog stays up. And if someone comes to our house, the dog barks and I get up and see who it is. If there is a stray cow and we catch it, we will walk to the market to sell the cow for profit. All of our cows are good so we should get a lot of profit. I will corral the cows and load them up. Hey, call. Hey, look, a stray dog wandering on the market. I think I'll take her home with me and round up some cattle. I think I'll go sell some chickens for some money because I did not get make much profit on a little pickup stand. Emily, Emily might have not been a good pickle salesman, but she was a great cowgirl. <laughs> my na my neighbor called me, and my pig was running great. I got on the horse, and I was going to my pig, but my pig went behind the market. The rancher was tending my duck when I got back from the market. I found my pig behind the market and I brought him home. I was so excited to have my little piggy back. He might got hurt by an alligator because they are alligators behind the market. He was hungry because he ate all of his food. He is happy that he is home.